Hey everyone welcome to Aero Raider the HAL TEDV, twin engine deck based fighter, is a significant step forward in India's pursuit of self-reliance in defense technology. Developed by the Aeronautical Development Agency and Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, HAL, the TEDBF is a naval multi-role fighter designed to operate from Indian aircraft carriers, replacing the aging MiG-29K fleet. With a projected service entry in the 2030s, the TEDBF is expected to play a crucial role in strengthening India's naval aviation capabilities, particularly in the Indian Ocean region, where India faces growing maritime challenges. The HAL TEDF is a twin engine, carrier capable fighter built with advanced design elements to optimize it for operations aboard India's aircraft carriers, including the indigenous INS Vikrant and the INS Vikramaditya. The need for a new fighter arose due to the obsolescence of the MiG-29K, which has been in service since 2009. The TEDBF is specifically designed to perform a wide range of missions, including air superiority, anti-ship strikes, maritime surveillance, and ground attacks. The aircraft features a delta-wing configuration combined with canards. This canard delta design is chosen for its superior maneuverability, stability, and control at both subsonic and supersonic speeds. The canard wings help in enhancing the aircraft's low-speed handling characteristics, which is critical during carrier launches and landings. The aircraft's overall aerodynamics and weight are optimized for carrier operations, ensuring it can be stored efficiently in the limited space available aboard naval vessels. Another distinctive feature of the TEDBF is its diverterless supersonic inlet. DSI, design, which enhances its radar cross-section reduction while improving engine performance. DSI is a critical element for naval aircraft, as it helps minimize the aircraft's radar signature and makes it harder to detect by enemy radars. Additionally, the TDBF features wing-folding mechanisms, enabling the aircraft to be compactly stored on an aircraft carrier thus saving valuable space for other operations. The HAL TEDF is expected to be equipped with a suite of modern avionic systems, including the indigenous UTOM Active Electronically Scanned Array AESA, radar, which is currently being developed for the Tejas MK2 program. AESA radars are known for their high-resolution imaging capabilities and ability to simultaneously track multiple targets at long ranges. The UTOM radar is expected to provide the TEDBF with superior detection, tracking, and targeting capabilities, enhancing its effectiveness in various operational environments, whether for air-to-air -air combat or maritime strikes. The aircraft's cockpit will feature the latest avionics, including wide area displays, multifunction displays, and hands-on throttle and stick HODAs, controls. These features are designed to minimize pilot workload, enabling the pilot to focus on mission objectives while ensuring the quick retrieval of critical flight information. The TEDBF will also incorporate Advanced Electronic Warfare EW, systems, which are expected to include jammers and radar warning receivers to counter threats from enemy radars and missiles. Point one of the most advanced systems being integrated into the TEDBF is AI-assisted landing and takeoff capabilities. The AI system will play a significant role in enhancing safety and operational efficiency during carrier operations, particularly in adverse weather conditions. The ability of the aircraft to execute autonomous landings and takeoffs could be a game changer, reducing the risk of human error and ensuring smoother operations on the high stress environment of a carrier deck. This system could significantly reduce the workload on the pilot especially during night operations or when the aircraft is operating in dense electronic warfare environments, the TEDBF will be powered by two General Electric F414 GE INS6 engines, each capable of producing 98 knots of thrust. These engines are an upgrade from the F404 engines used in the Tejas MK1, providing the TEDBF with superior thrust-to-weight ratios and better overall performance. The F414 engine is known for its reliability and efficiency, making it an ideal choice for carrier-based operations where both thrust and endurance are critical for a variety of missions.